Welcome you gorgeous and beautiful people from the internet, my name is Manzor and today we're gonna play Resident Evil 2, the original on PS1. Hopefully you guys do enjoy this, if you do leave a like, subscribe if you're new and let's get into it. We're gonna play Leon A right now Resident Evil 2. on normal difficulty. Normally I play this with infinite ammo so let's see how things go. Sit back, relax and enjoy. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb called Raccoon City. It was later revealed that the terrible disaster had been caused by the T-Virus, a mutagenic toxin created by the international enterprise Umbrella Incorporated for use in bioweapon experiments. The Raccoon City Police Department's Special Stars Unit immediately began investigation of the affair. The case was apparently closed, thanks to the efforts of STARS members Chris Redfield and Jill Valentine. But the Umbrella Corporation's experiments were far from finished. What have we got here? Guy's a maniac. Why'd he bite me? Can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah, first day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it with you. Station. 
I'll meet you there. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> Out of cash. They were parted by an unescapable destiny. This is the beginning of their worst nightmare. Okay, so first of all, I need to press uh, this button, right? Yeah, there we go. And we're gonna change uh, type A to type C. Now, it's the same buttons as type A, but the only difference is that it's automatic aiming. So now, when I press aim, it will automatically aim. Kendo. Freeze! Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human! <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Wait, Kendo doesn't call Leon a, um... a darling? <laughs> Okay, guys, we're still not gonna get Brad because no infinite ammo means no th for me, dog. I want a shotgun, though. Okay, I, I took a little bit too long to press X, so we're gonna take a little bit of damage here. Take this ammo also. Shotgun only has four shells. That's uh, that's Gucci, I think. We run all the way here. Get some more ammo. So Leon can actually upgrade his pistol though, uh, which is something we'll definitely do. Okay, don't waste ammo now. Uchi, <laughs> almost ran straight into that guy. That would not have been good. Also guys, from round 4 we can only make our videos 20 minutes long, so once we hit that, uh, hit that threshold, uh, I'll find a safe place to save, and then obviously we'll continue on with the next video. There is multiple reasons why I'm doing this. Number one is I don't want to waste you guys' time. Number two is the fact that... Oh, nice doge. Is the fact that our average watch time, even though as a streamer back in the day, is 8 minutes. So, if we have streamed as much as we did, and we still only have 8 minutes of watch time, there's no, need, there's no need to make videos longer than a certain time. So, I think 20 minutes is a good place. Nice, he's down, but he's not dead. Since I'm playing on, on the EPSXE, we can pretty much save wherever we want. Uh, there's only a few games that I can uh, cannot save wherever I want, though. Okay, there's no ammo inside the police car. Easy doji. Also, we just finished Claire, which is awesome. This is uh, the next part you guys will see, even though it's not lining up with the story. Because if you play Claire A, you should be playing Leon B. 
But we're gonna play Leon A first. Because I think it's the A run is a little bit easier than the B run. You pretty much start off with liquors in the B run very early in the game, so. Uh. Oh man. Who who are you? Oh, you must be the new guy. Leon. Sorry, but it looks like your party has been cancelled. What happened? About two months ago, there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other STARS members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the truth, but no one believed them. Not long after that, all this started to happen. Uh, uh, hang in there. Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But... Just go! Okay, Will Smith, I'll go. Fine, but I'm coming back for you. Just hold on! It looks like Will Smith, right? Back in the 80s. I don't remember what show he was on, but uh, it definitely looks exactly like that. <laughs> Anyway, getting more ammo here, using the key card. Full slide doors. Doors can be unlocked by the card key. Let's do that. So this will unlock two doors for us. The whole doors is now released. So now we can use that. Don't mind if I do. So upcoming liquor. I would like to take care of it with the shotgun. Let's just have a look at our inventory. Uh, the knife in Resident Evil 2 is pretty terrible. I, sh I, I showed you guys in the previous run. I'm going to drop the knife in the middle of nowhere. Never going to use it ever in this game. And then we'll go. Now Leon has a... You see this a desk is locked. We can't open it. Leon has a lighter, where Claire has a lockpick. And the downfall is that the lighter is only being used twice in this whole run, where the lockpick is used multiple times. I'm gonna run past him, right behind him, I'm gonna switch to my shotgun. Let's shoot him. Three bullets to kill, I'll take that. Don't mind if I do. Let's do this. And onwards we go. Now, we didn't get the stars card because we didn't get uh, to kill Brad. Also, guys, in the very first part, I did read all the documents I could. So we're not going to do it inside this run. So we use the lighter here. And we get our first gem. Which will be used very late in the game. I don't know if I should do the B runs with infinite ammo though. Might not be a bad idea. Let me know guys, by the time you watch this video, I'm pretty sure I still haven't recorded the B runs, so be sure to let me know whether you want to see infinite ammo with B runs or not. And there we go, our shotgun is done. 
Killed the Rebecca looking Zombo. That one's also dead. That one's also dead. Yeah, the knife is definitely not worth. I thought there might be another zombie here. Because he was looking around, I was like, why are you looking, dude? That's also a cool thing about Resident Evil 2 compared to Resident Evil 1. In Resident Evil 2, uh, Leon is actually looking around for enemies, where Chris and Jill is not. Their head is stationary, looking at one spot, whether there's enemies or not. So this is the door you can open, but Leon only gets a different clothes. But the cool thing about that is that Leon also holds his pistol differently. Where he's aiming right now, he has two hands, but when you have that cool looking suit, he holds the pistol only in one hand, and it holding it sideways like a gangster, if that makes any sense. And it doesn't affect headshots, it's still pretty much poor, regardless whether you use the skill or not. Okay, we're just gonna move these two statues over here to get the GM of Doom. I'm gonna try and walk through as... Oh, well, not walk through, but like, play through as many games as possible, guys. I know at this moment you might think that this is just a PS1 channel. It's not, okay? I'm just starting at PS1. We are eventually going to move to PS2 games, but for now, this is where we are. We're going to play a lot, a lot of different PS1 games. A lot. Even games that people didn't suggest that I remember, remember that was really good when I was a child. That's why I'm covering a lot of Digimon World 1 and 2 so far. I'm eventually going to move into Digimon World 3. Once I'm done with Digimon World 2, of course, which will take a very long time. <laughs> okay, we should get our... Let me guess, let me guess. What do we get in your Magnum. Okay, we're getting a shotgun again. I'll take it because it has five ammo. I don't want to waste that ammo. We're also getting a spray in here. And then over here, we should be getting the emblem also. Now, I think Jill will meet us inside here. I did read Chris's diary in the previous part, so I'm not going to read that again. And I think Claire will be entering the room now. There we go. Leon! It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not going to find your brother here. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Alrighty then. No ammo around here. So we're gonna just exit. The problem is there was two zombies here that I didn't touch before. We gotta turn instantly and run. There we go. Not too bad at all. That's really good. So I know by making my parts only 20 minutes, there's gonna be so many parts uploaded for each game, and I do understand that. But the thing is, I'm wasting my own time for recording long, super long videos. Um then I might as well just have streamed, if that makes any sense. But guys, this is where part one is going to end. I'm just going to fix my inventory, because it is roughly 20 minutes right now. We're about to enter it. So we're going to fix our inventory quickly. We don't need the first aid spray for now. Um, 
I also want to move that shotgun to a place that we don't really will see it anymore. Because it has zero ammo. So we'll put it next to the knife. We don't want to see it anymore. Uh, then we can put away a little planty so we can use it later in the game. And both gems is going to be used very, very soon. Very, very soon. I'm just thinking... I don't need the shotgun right now, so we'll put it away also. And this will be my inventory for the next part. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, smash up that like, subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you guys in the very next video. Love you guys, take care, and as always, remember to twist some nips. Peace.